How are you? So I'm currently doing a thing on my Instagram, right? Well, it's gonna be a reel, you know, when it goes like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. I'm gonna do a can for every single day that I've had. So I've had a couple of command ones, a couple of monsters. I mean, it, it might be shit, but if you don't try, you'll never know. So if you have not already seen this, this is the new command range from my protein. It's technically a gaming product, right? But the product is literally called Nootropic. It's command Nootropic, right? In the, nearly dropped it, in the tropical. So it's command Nootropic, tropical flavor. There's four flavors, grape, Blue Raz and Apple are the other ones, Green Apple, but this is my favourite. I'm going to be using this to train today, purely because it has the focus factors that I look for in a pre, right? I, I enjoy having a bit of a caffeine kick and the focus. I just like the taste of this product, I like the effects of this product. So I'm going to be training with it today. Know that you can use this as a pre-workout as well. You can get 40 servings of it and the code LSJ still works because they haven't done the official launch. When they do that, it probably won't. If you want some or you want to give it a go, now's your time. I'm going to be using this today. Magical. So if you have not already guessed by the title, today is an exciting day, ladies and gents. As you guys know, I have recently been recovering from um, a knee injury, leg injury, however you want to put it. I was kind of written off for a good few months when it came to leg training and stuff, right? We've slowly but surely built that back up and I've decided that my progression for this week is not gonna be an extra leg day where I do my things like my leg press and stuff. I'm gonna incorporate some deadlifts, some slightly more functional stuff than being sat doing a leg press. Granted, leg press is probably one of the safest things that I could possibly be doing. So, we're pushing the boat out a little bit today. I kinda, I, to be honest, I've got to the point where I'm like, fuck it, you know? Quite frankly, Fuck that. Today I'm gonna to take my time, I'm gonna warm up on the bike for a good, probably 10 minutes or so. Um, it's not, It's actually really cold in here, it's not too bad. Uh, but we've got the heaters on, I'm gonna get biking. And we'll get warming up and get going. Absolutely buzzing to set a warmer at max PR today. <laughs> kilo deadlift right so the reason I've done this is because the plates are still a good size I was gonna go for the tens to go for a 40 kilo deadlift but the tens are like half the size of these plates right so I would have to go it's almost like a deficit deadlift you know what I mean so that would make it harder than it actually would be to do a regular deadlift I'd rather go a little bit heavier and enter back in at 60 kilos and just see how we go tempo slow, controlled. We can get a good deadlift out of this, right? Because it would usually be this high anyway. So we're just gonna go 60 kilos, straight back in with that and see how we get on. Bearing in mind, we're not going for one rep maxes. We're not trying to hit PBs. We are literally just trying to comfortably and pain-free shift some weight, right? That is, that's literally it, okay? So one thing that I wanna work on as well it's my flexibility in the range of motion because coming down here, obviously now is a lot less easy than it was a few months ago because I haven't done it for a long time. So we will work on that, but um, just know that I'm aware, aware of it from the start, you know? So here goes nothing. Drop the video a like. Let's do this. 
<웃음> 아... also good because it means I can pretty much start my deadlifting from scratch. Obviously I really want to be sinking a little bit lower into it like this but we'll get there, we'll, we'll improve on that as the weeks go by. So just going to do a few more. Nice slow steady pace focusing on keeping my feet planted like so. Even drive with the legs. Okay good. I'm happy with this. Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that for now. I don't think we're going to go any heavier. I think what we're going to do is just go through the motions with that to start off with. We'll do a couple more sets on that, but a few minutes rest in between. And we'll take that for this time. And then we'll just go on with a regular push day, you know, a pull day, sorry. Pull downs, pull ups, etc., etc. But really, really happy with that. A few minutes rest. And then we go. absolutely buzzing to do a couple of sets on 60 kilos just because my body allowed me to do it. That's mad. Just the flexion in the knee that I couldn't do without pain before, I, I can do now. Roughly, kind of. I mean obviously it needs to improve but I'll take that for today. I'm, I'm really really happy with that. It's mad how your mindset kind of changes, you know. I can't wait to build some massive legs and have a massive deadlift <laughs> just because it's the things that I've not been able to do, you know? It's even affected like my bench, like the other day. <laughs> Sub that set. It's even affected my bench, like when I was uh, benching the other day, I still can't really and haven't really planted my feet properly for a bench press, right? So I'm doing my bench press 100 kilos, right? Which really shouldn't be that bad. Should probably get it for three, four. I got it for two, but because I've got no leg drive, you know? So I'm just excited to get things back to as normal as I possibly can, as soon as I possibly can. But again, slowly but surely, slow and steady, wins the race, y'all, when it comes to a lot of things in life. This being one of them. coming in the next few days. I'm filming it potentially tomorrow, you're not going to see it tomorrow. It's going to go live over the next few days, explaining kind of the physique updates, some of the clips that you guys just saw, my thoughts about where I'm at, the progress that I've made, the, the gains I've made, the gains I've not made, all this kind of stuff, weight goals, transformation goals, competing goals um, over the next couple of years, few years. Obviously, I have plans to do things like that. So, 
stay tuned for that. And also let me know if you want to see something similar or something to do with that in the comment section down below. That would really help. Obviously, I'm trying to pump out as many videos as I possibly can. That turnaround time and that volume of videos, obviously, um, it, it can be difficult at times. So... Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. We've got a couple of boxes as well, which you guys will be seeing more of in the next few videos. I've got so much to tell you, like so much to tell you, but I can't tell you half of the stuff that I need to tell you yet because one, it would jinx stuff, and two, I'm not allowed to, right? So a few things are coming. Uh, not only that, I'm going to be working on some new clothing projects coming soon. Um, what well, by clothing projects, I just mean merch, like my, my emblem on more things than just a bubble hat. Uh, hoodies are very highly requested and t-shirts as well. Um, things like that will be coming in the near future. But obviously with COVID and everything like that, things are happening a little bit slower than I planned. Um, I do have plans kind of in place, but nothing is happening. I'm going to be straight up with you. So they are coming as soon as I possibly can. Just bear with me, all right? So, physique update, all that kind of stuff, diet update, full days of eating, coming very, very soon. Highly requested videos, I'm on it, people. I hear you. So if you have an idea for another video that I haven't mentioned or haven't done for a while, stick it in the comments. I hope you've enjoyed this one, though. If you have, do me a massive favor. Cost you nothing, takes you two seconds, and we are smashing it lately. Let's smash 75 likes on this video. If we can get that consistently, you will see the growth of the channel go up and up and up, building that momentum every single time. If you take the time, just to just really kind of emphasize the fact that if you take that few seconds out of your day to like the video, the channel will grow. It is as simple as that. Commenting, even better. Sharing, well, aren't you just a legend? You know, all of the above really, really helps. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed it. Like, comment, share, subscribe, all that YouTube jazz. Thank you for all of your support throughout 2020 and smashing 2021 so far. You're a bunch of freaking legends. I'll see you in the next one.